Yeah, so I agree. I saw Laff play a little bit earlier, and I do think that he's uh, looking pretty strong today. And he, unlike... Uh, we had a lot of commentary earlier with some other Kirby's about trying to use those up tilts and follow up on those combos. And I think uh, spacing those up tilts is something that I was really impressed with him uh, doing pretty well. Uh, yeah, he, he was up tilting me, I DI'd away, and he just pivot up tilted and kept going. Uh, that's not something that you are going to see from a lot of D4 players. And there he does begin those up tilt combos, look for the neutral air. Let's get caught in the grab. Let's see how Gilly Gill's edge guard is looking. Doesn't keep him off the side. Oh, dash attacks into a back throw, so not a great, not a great move. Uh, yeah, I I Gilly Gill's had some up tilts as well. Yep. Oh, got caught. Yep, and so then uh, positioning for that down air, one of the one of the few options that Pikachu had for recovering there. Probably not the only option, but the most likely one from a lot of players. Oh, Ooh, oh but he misses his zip zap, so Laugh actually goes up. All right, Gilly Gil getting some pressure on during his invincibility frames. But gets caught by a down air down and smash, a down smash. And a second and down air. Oh. Third Ooh, down here. I'm That's really liking this edge guard game I'm seeing from left. That was nice. Yeah, three to one. I mean, one of them was pretty significant SD, and there's a ton of damage, but I mean, that's just how the game goes. You have to actually win it. Mm -hmm. Good reaction. You know, you got hit with that aerial. There's not nearly enough hits done at that low percentage. Mm -hmm. Throws back a, a neutral air. A couple of rolls there. Oh, oh left missing the edge of this down air, putting him in a little bit of tech spot. Well, he turns it around. There it is. Yeah. Gilly, Gilly I think he's trying to, like, get a teeter cancel or position himself on the edge. Just walks a little too far, and that's the game. Yeah. But, you know, I, I don't necessarily expect the next game to look like that just because it's a three stock. Like mm -hmm. I said, there was that SD. There's the ton of damage. I mean, the game could have been a lot closer than it was. Yeah, I agree. So let's see what Gilly, Gilly can do. Got some jabs. Uh, yeah, I think He's the, really racking up I the think damage. the jab actually interrupted a forward air, which was fantastic. Mm -hmm. Oh, but a shield break. Let's yep. see what Laugh wants to do out of that. We can, oh, nice. I love to see that. There it is. Up tilt, up tilt, jump, reverse back air. We can get down. Yeah. That forward smash, you're going to get punished from that position every time. That one, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Gilly Gil worrying me a little bit, positioning himself beneath the Kirby off the, uh, off the edge. Offs for the neutral air. Get Gilly Gil off the edge. But doesn't manage to follow up with the down air and gets caught. Now it's his turn to recover, but it looks like... Oh, you know, I mean... You know, why not? It well, just racks up a little extra damage. If you had done it a little bit earlier, it might have uh, been a more effective edge guard. Oh, but okay. he does take that one away with a well-timed up smash. So it's just the 94%. Oh, it's a bit more now. Okay. Okay, so a one-stock lead for left. Still anyone's game. Yeah, Gilly Gil trying to figure out how to approach through those up airs. Doesn't successfully do it, and you know, a Kirby can really punish you for that. Yep. And it does well. happen. All right, now we've got a real a three to one situation for Gilly Gil, so gotta dig deep and not get up tilted. Good start. Tilt time. Oh. That's, that's called it. out on the on the get up attack. 
All right, so yeah. Yeah, laugh tacking that one pretty handily. I do really think, I think you're right, that he's looking stronger than a lot of the players we're seeing in D4. And uh, yeah, I definitely expect to see him make it through. See who's up next. 